South Korea has developed its maritime industries to the point where it's now a world leader in the sector. To learn about Korea's maritime sector, representatives from around the world gathered in Busan this week. Our Kim Dami was there. Members of the International Maritime Organization were in the South Korean port city of Busan this week to observe the world's best maritime knowledge and practices. After previously running knowledge sharing programs on finance and economy, the European Bank for Reconstruction and Development invited representatives from six countries, including Egypt, Morocco, and Turkey, to learn about Korea's maritime industry. For the first stop of the maritime program, the representatives toured Busan's old port, which once was a shelter for refugees during the Korean War, but is now the world's fifth biggest container port. Next, they visited Busan New Port, which has been under development since 1994. The visitors were impressed by how Busan has developed its infrastructure to become a leader in international trade. Korea is the perfect example how you can use and develop your maritime domain and the capabilities. And Busan is one of the showcase for the rest of us, for the rest of the world to see how we can develop also in that direction, especially in developing our port infrastructure, port sector, and in a, to, to attract also the foreign trade in our ports. Uh, Maritime Single Window is a project to connect all port authorities, all government authorities, and uh, all port business in one, uh, let's say, blockchain in one cloud. And it will be very interesting to implement this project uh, in Ukrainian seaports. We have already started this project, but uh, in Korea it's like on the finished stage. It's already done and its function is really good. Nurturing its shipping industry from the late 1990s onwards, South Korea has reached a stage where it is able to pass down its knowledge and experience and become a rule maker in maritime policy as well as in the shipbuilding industry. As a country that transformed itself from a recipient to a donor nation, South Korea is qualified to pass down its knowledge. Our program previously focused on economy and finance, and we're willing to share any fields of experience that other countries are interested in. These representatives will take the knowledge they've learned in Busan back to their home countries, but they'll return to Korea in the near future to explore other fields of Korea's expertise. Kim Dami, Arirang News, Busan.